there, I'm Nancy Shaw with Healthy Living. Today our guest is Keisha Place-Fensel. Hi Keisha, thanks for joining us today. Hi Nancy, thanks for having me. We're really excited because spring is coming up and with spring comes our Dam to Dam training program. Yes. Which is going to be starting soon. It is. So what can you tell us about our Dam to Dam training program? It's, by the way, it's our 14th annual program. So our training program begins on Tuesday, March 22nd at 5.30 p.m. here at City Hall. And we will um, start with an introduction and then a short run that evening. And the training program goes through? Through Dam to Dam. Dam to Dam. Which? Dam to Dam is on Saturday, June 4th um, down in Des Moines. And so we're training for that 13.1 mile run. And who, um, who do you like to see join the training group? Do they need to have running experience? Um, yes, they do need to have running experience, but as long as they can run four continuous miles um, by that March 22nd date, that is all they need to have in terms of their, their base. Okay. Um, the reason we have that in place is to help prevent injuries um, because we are going to be building up our mileage and so making sure that they have been running for a while um, and making sure that they're coming into the program already injury free um, and then if they are somebody who maybe has done that distance before and wants to revisit it and hasn't done it for a while or somebody who is new to that distance um, we kind of build up the program a little bit slowly so they can get more information um, at an informational meeting okay um, that we are going to have here at City Hall on Tuesday uh, March 8th and that will be at 6 30 p.m. okay um, so we'll answer a lot more right. of those types of questions yeah. there. Because I know there's a lot of individual questions exactly. people have when they start or when they undergo a training program in that length of Exactly. Of and, and there's always going to be, well, what about this situation or what about right. this situation? And that's where I can answer those questions in a little right. bit Individually. Yeah. So the training program meets twice a week. It's correct. Does. And yes. what, what are the days that it will be meeting? Um, we meet on Tuesdays, every Tuesday at 5.30 p.m. here mm -hmm. at City Hall. Uh, we have a run. And then we also have an educational session, okay. um, which I'll talk a little bit more about in a couple of minutes. And then we meet on Saturday mornings at 8 a.m. to start with when our runs on Saturdays are a little bit shorter. Once they get a little bit longer, then we'll move the time back to 7 a.m. start time. Um, and we meet at various locations around town to run not the same route That's all the time, nice. but just kind of vary it up a little bit. And so. you have all the paths figured out for people. You have water planted along yep. the way, so it's really very helpful when you're doing those long runs. Yeah, so things that they get when they sign up for the program, which by the way, the program um, is $84 for residents of Ames and $89 for non-residents. Mm -hmm. um, but things that are included with that would be they do get a training program uh, outlined specifically for what types and distances of runs they should be doing each day or week um, to kind of prepare them for that 13.1 mile run. They get the routes, as you mentioned, where right. I put out water and Gatorade and make sure that they stay hydrated. Um, and then I mentioned those educational sessions that we do on Tuesdays. Yeah. Anything from bringing in a physical therapist to talk about injury prevention or bringing in a nutritionist from Iowa State to talk about everyday nutrition as well right. as race day nutrition. Uh, we bring in a shoe fit expert. So just a variety a of different of helpful exactly. information. Exactly. Um, and they do get a t-shirt to wear as Can't well. Can't forget about so. the t-shirt. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> and really the biggest bonus I think that they get is the camaraderie, yes, the, they the do. motivation from each other, the um, like-minded individuals that they get to meet right. and, and new friendships that they, they get to develop. And it so. seems like every year um, with your group you have people who kind of have the same running speeds because you do have such a variance of people that somebody always has a running speed similar to another person so they can run with somebody Absolutely. and not. It's amazing. We, we never have had anybody right have to run on their own. Right. They always Which seem to, really to pair up quite well. So. Really great. And it's great to have you there for guidance and suggestions and help along the way. So Because it is a big undertaking for someone to train for a half marathon. It is, absolutely. And um, one thing I did not mention was the fee for registering for the mm -hmm. class does not include the registration for True. Dam to Dam. Right. Simply because Dam to Dam doesn't necessarily fit into everybody's schedule, right. but it'll give them the basis, the basis. and the, 
and the information that they need where they could potentially do a different half Right. Yes, because marathon. we've had people do that. They mm -hmm. sign up for the training group and then they're training for another half exactly. marathon somewhere in the state. or Exactly. So, very good. Well, we're excited to have a start. We're excited for spring to be here and to start yes. our Dam to Dam spring training program. Again, the training program um, begins March 22nd. Yes. Um, it meets here at the community center. So if you have more questions, you can give us a call at 239-5350 or you can register online or check out all our programs online at amesparkrec.org. Keisha, thank you so much for joining us and we're thank excited to get our training program underway. I'm excited, I can't wait. Thanks, Nancy. Yes, thank you. And again, I'm Nancy Shaw with Healthy Living and remember, it's never too late to get fit. Mm -hmm.